Hello Dave, this is AdFree. Thanks to all you guys supporting the channel on Patreon. All income from donations and Patreon are used directly to upgrade cameras, light, microphones, software, things that allow me to produce more and better looking videos for you guys. All Patreons also get a discount at the merch store and you have the option to get your name listed at the end of every video. So become a Patreon by following the link in the video description. Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Hello Dave with Antwerp Astronomy. It's Monday, so let's take a look at what's been going on in Elite and on the channel. First, just as with many other companies, Frontier has sent all their employees home to work remotely. This was posted last week. Um, along with the post, they also said that this is not planned to cause any delays across all their titles. So that would also include the launch of fleet carriers, but a lot of people have been speculating whether this would mean there would be delays uh, on that front. Um, however, it doesn't seem to be the case. But of course, these are well times where things change quickly and it's hard to make predictions about what's going to happen. But for now, they're not planning any um, delays to the release of, of fleet carriers or any of the other uh, updates for Elite for that matter. Um, but again, all the employees are now working from home. That has one consequence, and that is, of course, that all Frontier live streams have been cancelled until further notice. Of course, they do all the live streaming from their main office, so that means they are going to have a hard time uh, making live streams in the foreseeable future. So at least until they have their staff back uh, on site, there will not be any Frontier live streams going on. Now, this is just a Frontier live stream. My live streams, of course, are still running uh, as scheduled because, well, I'm streaming from home. Now, in these troubled times, commanders are reaching out and helping each other. Now, the East India Company, um, a group where you could usually go and if you needed specific materials for unlocking engineers, whether that be rare components, or maybe meta alloys, whatever that is, you could go to them, you could hand over Imperial Slave, which you can buy off the market for cash, and then they would give you the materials needed to unlock a specific engineer. They have now started a new project called Operation Helping Hand, and that's been running since the 21st of March, and it's running in the next four weeks. So by the time that would be last Saturday, just looking at the calendar there. Um, and so for the next four weeks, they're running Operation Helping Hand, where you can get materials for unlocking engineers for free from them. So you don't have to hand over the Imperial slaves as compensation. So if you are in the process of unlocking engineers, if you have a few engineers that you haven't unlocked because there's just that annoying commodity that you don't want to spend the time getting your hands on, then there's no better time than doing it right now. And uh, so reach out to uh, to the East India Company. I'll put a link for their site in the description below. So you can go over there and they have a site where you can go and you can either order if you have materials, but also if you that you want to trade, but also if you need materials, you can go and you can, you can sign up for it there. And, and, and then the trade will happen in game. Obviously, um, you would have to find someone on the same platform as you and all that stuff. But yeah, and again, if you have engineers, you want to unlock them. Operation Helping Hand is now in progress, so go check it out if you want to unlock a few engineers. Talking about giving a helping hand, uh, yesterday, Sunday evening, I posted a video announcing the D2A Fold at Home. If you haven't been following the whole Fold at Home thing, it's basically when you do research on both stuff like cancer research or Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, but also the latest um, pandemic that's roaming around, one of the things you do is you do computer simulations of protein folding, because I'm by no means an expert on this, but from what I read on their the, the site, they're based on the way the protein folds, different things happened. And uh, problem is these kind of, um, of simulations require a tremendous amount of compute power. And that's why they have set up a project called Fold at Home, where people can use their home computers to do protein folding simulations that will then help further that research. To help uh, the research to combat the pandemic that's running around at the moment, I've started the D2EA Fold at Home team. It's basically where well, commanders and members of this community, we can join up on a team and we can begin folding proteins when our computers are not doing anything. I mean, this is a gaming community and 
most people, a lot of people in a gaming community have relatively powerful PCs standing around that's not doing a whole lot during the day. This is a good chance to use some of those compute resources for something good that can help, well, everybody. So I'll put a link to it in the description as well, the video where I go over how you set it up and how you join the team and what you need to do. But basically you can just set your computer to use any spare resources it has to do protein folding simulations, which then help further the research. And then of course, the final topic for today will be live streams. My live stream again will be at the same time as usual tomorrow, eight o'clock in game time. The exact topic of the live stream, I'm not really 100% sure about yet. It's gonna be one of those, you know, I'll figure it out as it comes along. I have been considering making an open live stream, so I will try to see if I can get that in place, especially now that uh, everybody's well at home and in quarantine anyway. I think it would be fun to do another open live stream, which I've done in the past. I'll figure out, I'm open for suggestion that the past we've done a lot of combat. I feel like I want to try to see if we can come up with with, uh, with something else, something fun to do. But I don't know, um, I have a few a few ideas for live stream tomorrow. I've been considering going back out and try to run some, uh, some listening posts. I've done that in the past and it's been a ton of fun to do so i've been considering doing something like that again i don't know but i'll see you tomorrow again you're more than welcome to post um to post suggestions if you have something specific you uh, you would like to see being live streamed then well by all means post in the description and i might consider it we'll see tomorrow what i come up with what i think could be fun but um yeah it's gonna be tomorrow it's gonna be eight o'clock in game time business as usual stream both here on youtube and on twitch i really hope i'll see you there that's gonna be it for this week thanks so much for watching and also next time I'll see you guys in space.